Hello guys! What's up? Subscribe to my channel before watching this video and like this channel. Bye! Let's get started! Miss Spider's Sunny Patch Friends Sing a long story. Miss Spider sat in her treetop home nervously, spinning five little blankets. It's too soon, she says. I'm not just ready to be a mother. Miss Spider's mom, Betty, tried to soothe her with a song. Your itsy bitsy spiders will love their mother so. Hush now, my darling, I will promise you. We'll know the answers are inside you. It's true that mom knows best soon. The love baby spider will feel your bugginess. Betty's song made Miss Spider feel better. And it was just in time be to because the eggs sang began to hatch. Outside Miss Spider's husband Holly was curling there on their way. Hurry. They named the yellow baby spinner, the green one squirt, the blue one wiggle, and the twins Pansy and Snowdrop. The little spiders were ready. The little spiders were re ready to explore their world. They all made webs, sailing them on the breeze. Like tiny surfboards, Miss Spider and Holly surfed alongside them. Miss Spider liked knowing that every day would be an adventure with their new family. From the sky, the spider brothers and sisters spotted something on the ground. They sailed down to investigate. It was a giant egg. Squirt was sad to see the egg all alone. Where is the egg, mom? Right? Who will take care of it when it hatches? All the spiders wanted to help. I bet if we paint the egg, said Spinner, it will feel loud, and maybe its mom will have an easier time finding it, said Pansy. That's a fine idea, said Miss Spider. She was proud of her kids already trying to help others. It was a spooky. It was spooky, so Squirt sang a song. I may be itsy bitsy, but I'm very brave. Must keep rolling like the dog you saved. Must find your mom, she's looking for you. To do it might get me in trouble, something must do. Just then, a hungry snake slithered out of the grass. And an egg, a little spider, she hissed. What a tasty meal. Squirt gave the cart a push downhill. Then hung on for his life. Boom, boom, boom. They were safe. That was close, gasped Squirt. But now he was lost in a foggy box. Shadows twisted airily. Strange noises echoed from the mist. All at once, three bugs pounced. They pinned poor squirt to the ground. Please don't eat me, he cried. We're bandit solar dragon and dragonfly. We're here to take your egg. But I've got to find its mom, cried squirt. 
Please, it's a lonely egg and it needs a home. A mom said bounce the bed bug. And she made the jewel beetle. We're looking for a mom too. Can you help us find one? Sorry. Back at the cozy hall, the spider and Holly soon realized Squirt was missing. They searched everywhere. Every bug helped the fireflies. He's just a baby, worried new spider. But he is a very smart spider, said Holly, just like his mother. He'll be fine. You'll see. Nope. No, I'm not angry. Squirt and his new friends were a good team. It was nice to have help looking for the egg's mom. But when the night got cold, the snow began to fall. They knew they had to find shelter. While Squirt was worried about his egg in the snow. Miss Spider worried about Squirt in the snow. She remembered how little a little song made her feel better, so she sang. Two itsy bitsy spiders are searching high and low. Two winter's night and two the good show. We'll find the Squirt and take him home and then now when you itsy bitsy family will be complete again. The squirt and his friends nearly frozen and so hungry. What is that smell? A shimmer. It's not that sweet smell of home cooking calf dragon. That's for sure. As if a cool doorway opened in the snow. A wave of a stinky foams came rolling out followed by a friendly green bug. Sitting is stink bug here said the funny smell on fellow. You look cold and hungry. Come inside and I'll make you my favorite snack. The stink was strong, but their hunger was stronger. So in a deep breath, the four of them sat down and slurped up a stinky home brood, green goo. It wasn't as bad as it looked. After dinner, Squirt felt homesick. He missed his family. They did even notice he was gone. At the very moment that he was thinking of his mom and dad, his mom and dad were thinking of him. Let's go this way, said Holly. I have a strong feeling that's when we went this direction. So, off. Uh, so off they went with each step. Miss Spider and Holly took. They felt a little closer finding Squirt. The next morning, Squirt, Shimmer, Bounce, and Dragon burst from a stinky door and good fresh air. Wow, I never felt any good smell so sweet, said Squirt. Let's get going. It's been a gas, said the stinky stuff. But anytime, and good luck with the chicken egg. A chicken egg? asked Bounce. It's a chicken egg. No chicken eggs? asked Shimmer. They were going to take the egg to the banyan when they heard the clock, 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 clock. It was a hen, and she was hungry. The little bugs ran for their lives. Squirt was just about to be gobbled when Miss Spider swung down on the tread and scooped him to safety. Mom, cried Squirt, I'm here. Miss Spider cried as she hugged her baby bug. Squirt's new friends were impressed with Miss Spider. You mom love, said Bounce. I wish I had my mom like her, said Dragon. 
me too, said Shimmer, and bounced. Just then everyone heard the tiny little cheep cheep cheep. The baby chick had the hatch. Not only was Quirt was back with his mother and father, but he had gotten the egg back with his mother too. Everyone had a family again. Everyone is except for Squirt and his friends. Squirt and his friends watched at the dragon shimmer and bounce, walk sadly towards the woods. I've always wanted a big family, said the spider. And eight is a perfect number, said Holly. Squirt overjoyed. Hey guys, he shouted. I found a mom and the dad for you too. Eight eats eight eats eight children. That's how the story ends. It's so different, yet you own them best. Dad so gentle, no other that good match. And there's a mom and greatest from in all of Sunny Pat. Let's sing again. <laughs> Your itsy bitsy spiders will love their mother so. Hush now, my darling, I promise you will. No, the answers I said you. It's true that mom knows the best. Soon as he loves the spread, 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 slow. I may be itty bitty, but I'm very brave. Must keep rolling, I get it to say. Must find your mom, she's looking for you too. So it might get trouble, something I must do. Two itty bitty spiders are searching high and low. We'll find the squirt and take him home and then our new itty bitty family will come promptly at the end. Eight itty bitty children, that's how the story ends. Each, each so different, yet you all the best. Best friend that talk, gentle, no other that could match and there's Mom, the greatest mom of all the science fetch friends. Happy birthday!